हेलो स्टूडेंट्स समग्र शिक्षा सिद्धिपेट प्रेजेंट्स आ वर्ल्ड थ्रू इंग्लिश क्लास सेवन यूनिट वन पेज नाइनटीन सी रीडिंग द न्यू ब्लू ड्रेस वेन स्प्रिंग केम टू द सिटी ऑफ क्लेवलैंड in 1909 it did not change gates avenue people who lived on the pretty streets near gates avenue were making gardens and painting their houses but gates avenue continued to look dirty and ugly gates avenue was a short street but it seemed longer because it was so ugly most of the families who lived there had very little money they never expected to have any more page 20 their houses had not been painted for many years and they did not even have running water the streets itself was ugly too there was no pavement there was no street light and the railroad at the end of gates avenue added noise and dirt the other girls in the school near gates avenue or new and pretty clothes that spring but the little girl from gates avenue still wore the dirty dress that she had on all winter probably that was the only dress she owned her teacher was very unhappy the little girl was nice she always worked hard in school she was always friendly and polite her face was dirty and her hair was untidy but anyone could see that she was pretty under the dirt One day the teacher said "Won't you wash your face before you come to school tomorrow morning? Please do that just for me." The next morning the child's pretty face was clean and her hair tidy. Before the little girl went home that afternoon the teacher said Now dear please ask your mother to wash your dress But the girl continued to wear the same dirty dress Her mother is probably not interested in her the teacher thought so she bought a bright blue dress and gave it to the little girl the child took the gift eagerly and rushed home page 21 The next morning she came to school in the new blue dress 
and she was very clean and tidy she told her teacher my mother could not believe her eyes when she saw me this morning in my new dress my father wasn't at home but he'll see me at supper tonight she was full of excitement when her father saw her in the new blue dress he was amazed to find that he had a very pretty little girl when the family ate supper he was even more amazed to see a cloth on the kitchen table the family had never used a table cloth before we are going to begin to be tidier here his wife said i'm ashamed to be dirty when our daughter is so clean after supper the mother began to wash the kitchen floor her husband watched silently for several moments then he went outside and began to repair the fence the next evening with the family's help he began to make a garden during the following week the man in the next house watched what his neighbor was doing and by the end of the week the man began to paint his house for the first time in 10 years a few days later the eng minister of a church near gates avenue passed this two houses and saw two men working for the first time he noticed that there was no pavement on gates avenue and no street light and no running water people who are trying so hard to make decent homes here deserves help the minister thought he asked some important citizens in the city to help them a few months later because of the eng minister there was a pavement on gates avenue there was a street light on the corner and the houses had running water 6 months after the little girl got her new blue dress gates avenue had become a tidy street where respectable citizens lived when people in other places heard the story of gates avenue they began to organize their own clean up campaigns since 1913 more than 7000 towns and cities have organized campaigns for painting and repairing homes and making better lives for the people who live in them who knows what will happen when a teacher gives a little girl a new blue dress thank you students